Hi guys, I'm Sonal and welcome to my channel. Today I'm making a vegetarian dish finally because I know that there are a lot of people who follow a vegetarian keto diet and it's a challenge for me to add these recipes because I don't really follow that diet but paneer is my favorite so I thought of making paneer tikka for you today. It's a simple dish, you just marinate it, put it on the pan and cook it. I'm using sheaves or skewers for this. If you don't have it, you can just directly put it on the pan and cook it. Let's go ahead and see how I make it. So we are making the marinade first and here I have some hung curd. I'm going to take about 60 grams of hung curd or Greek yogurt. If you don't have hung curd, you can take Greek yogurt. To this I'm adding 1 teaspoon of heavy cream and I mixed it. Half a teaspoon of garlic paste and 1 4 teaspoon of ginger paste. This is some green chili and coriander paste. So I've taken 1 teaspoon and 1 4 teaspoon of black salt. 1 4 teaspoon of fennel seed powder and 1 4 teaspoon of chaat masala 1 teaspoon of lemon juice and half a teaspoon of black pepper powder if you don't eat very spicy you can leave the green chili paste and the black pepper powder out i'm mixing this up thoroughly and our marinade is ready and here i'm cutting uh, fairly large pieces of the paneer because i want to put it in a sheet or skewer so you want them to hold well so this is about 200 grams of paneer which i have taken here you can see this is fresh paneer and it's really soft so you want to apply the paste really carefully to it making sure that you don't break it so i'm applying it to each and every piece and all the sides of the paneer and placing that in the plate and then i'm going to start putting it on the skewers so our paneer is ready and these are the skewers I have tied two skewers with a copper wire because it just gives more stability and also when you want to flip it, it's easier or your paneer can keep rotating on the sheet or the skewer when you flip it over. I'm also adding some green peppers and cherry tomatoes. You can add any vegetables that you like. You can add mushrooms also. It's just that mushrooms will leave out some water so be careful with that. This is a cast iron pan and I've added some ghee to it and I've placed my skewers on this. You can cook yours in the oven if you like. I just find it much quicker uh, because you don't have to waste the energy to heat the oven up. You can just put it on the pan and within like about 5 minutes this is done. I'm flipping the sheet over now. This paneer is really soft and it can be eaten raw because it's a cheese. Um, the only reason to do this is to let the masala or the marinade cook a little bit and also it gives it a nice brown color which looks appetizing so here our sheets are ready our paneer is ready and I'm just garnishing it with some chilies and I'm going to show you how soft and tender it is especially once you warm it up a little bit like we did uh, it's really nice and soft and tender you want to serve it warm and you want to eat it warm because the fat from the paneer you know sort of softens and it's really wonderful in your mouth it gives a nice mouth feel as well as it's very tasty so look at it when i poke the fork it's so soft my mouth is watering it's also a great presentation so if you want to make it for a crowd it's great so i hope you've enjoyed watching this recipe and you'll give it a thumbs up and also subscribe to my channel if you haven't already once you subscribe, there's a notification bell that will appear. If you click on the bell, you will be notified every time that I add a new recipe. Thanks for watching. Bye.